Hello everyone. Today um, I'm be making some uh, ham smoked picnic half slice. Um, and if you're new to my channel, my channel is Cooking Mom. I also have another channel that's Coupon Clicking Mom. And I'm gonna cook some tomatoes. And I got some fat back grease, some green beans, and I got some rice. And I've already washed my rice, so let's get started. Okay. I'm going to open my tomatoes first. Ooh. I'm cooking two cans of tomatoes. And just pour them in your can. I mean, pour them in your pot. And we're going to add a little bit of water to them. Oh, Okay, that's two cans of tomatoes. We've got a half a can each of water, or either one can. I was just getting the juice out of there. We can put some salt. Put about a about a fourth a teaspoon probably. I didn't have my measuring spoon, so I used the tip of my hand in the cup, the palm of my hand. Just found my measuring spoon. <laughs> All right, this is um, fat back grease. Oops. And I'm gonna use about a teaspoon and a half. If we need more, we can add, we can always add more. So I'm gonna put that on the stove. Turn the burner on. I ain't gonna put that up yet because we're gonna use it again. All right, next thing we're going to get our green beans ready. And I'm going to rinse these off. I'm going to drain them and rinse them off. Okay, get my other pot. I rinse them about three times. I'm going to put me some water in them. About a can of water. Do a little bit more. About a can and a half. Cause you want them to boil down a little bit. All right, we're gonna do some more salt. A little bit too much. All right, it's roughly a fourth of a teaspoon. And I'm just gonna do. A teaspoon of fat back grease for the string beans. And I got my water heating up for my um, rice. Put this on. Okay, I'll put about a fourth a teaspoon of salt. You just have to um, salt it to your taste and my water's beginning to get hot and um, I've washed my rice numerous times and it's because it, it's just about dry and I, I put like two cups of water in here let this sit for a few minutes stir it up let it boil a little bit and give it a stir all right you're going to continue to let it boil stir just very little and this type of rice is hard to get done so It's all these ram rice. I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit. I added another about another half a cup of water because this, like I said, the rice that I'm cooking is all these rice. It takes longer to cook, so I, I always check mine and make sure it's getting kind of tender before I cut it down and put the lid on it. So 
and it's not gonna hurt it to add a little more water to it so main thing is not stirring it a lot Let's see my tomatoes is finally starting to boil and if you like yours more with a sweeter taste you could put a little bit of sugar in them but I like mine like this if you want your water to kind of boil down it's getting close to the point where I can turn it down and put my lid on it and let it finish cooking. Alright, my rice is cooked down enough and I'm just going to turn it down and I'm going to put it on this other burner and um, let it continue cooking. And put it on this back burner. And we're going to uh, cook us some ham. I sprayed my... Um, Pan, and I'm gonna spray a little bit more. Let it get good and hot. Turn my burner back up. Oh, yeah. Now I'm gonna cook this not real brown because um, I don't like mine brown, but my husband does. So I'm gonna have to cook one light and one dark, darker, because he likes the darker ham. So anyway, but I'm for the video, I'm just gonna do it lighter. It's up to you how you like your ham cooked. So and it don't take long to cook the ham. So. I say it don't take long to cook your ham. Back up. Get them cooking. That's all it is to cooking ham. That's the simplest thing to cook. You like yours real brown, you can cook it longer. But I think if you cook it less, just just enough to get a little brown, it's more tender. So. Up. Take this one up. Put another piece in the pan. Put a little more spray in it. Good drippings in there now. Turn it down a little bit because I got some more. Mm 
And that one, pan was a lot hotter, so it didn't take that one that long. So I got two more. Add more spray as needed. That ham is just about done. Go ahead and cut my burner off. Take it, take it up. There you have it. All right, everyone. There is my ham. And I got my tomatoes and my string beans and my rice still cooking. But, um... And my battery was about to die on my phone, so I got it plugged, so. So that's the tomatoes. And my string beans. See? And you just want them to cook down, because they're about there. And you want this to cook down just a teeny bit more. And my rice, I'm not going to open my rice, because this will probably be done in a minute, so. All right, my string beans are done, my rice is done, and my tomatoes is done. And see, you want your rice to be flaky. Like that. Like that spoon on. And then the tomatoes. So you want them kind of to thicken up a little bit. And I hadn't put no pepper in them yet. <clears throat> but I'm going to put some pepper in them. <clears throat> They're good. Plus that, um, like I said, that um, fat back grease gives it good flavor. So, anyway, I just throw this clip in there with my ham. So, but anyway, um, like I said, that's how you cook ham. And I did the rice and tomatoes and string beans. Anyway, if you like my videos... Go on there um, and subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, comment, and share. And thanks for watching.